क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी वन अ पेशेंट प्रेजेंट विथ क्लो हैंड आफ्टर अ सुपराकोंडाल फ्रैक्चर वॉज रिड्यूस्ड एंड प्लास्टर अप्लाइड द डायग्नोसिस इज ऑप्शन ए मीडियन नव इंजरी बी वॉकमेंस इस्टेमिक कॉन्ट्रैक्चर सी अल्ला नव इंजरी ऑप्शन डी डुप्यूट्रेन्स कॉन्ट्रैक्चर एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी वॉकमेंस इस्टेमिक कॉन्ट्रैक्चर क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी टू डिस्लोकेशन ऑफ विच वन ऑफ द कार्पल बोन्स कैन प्रेजेंट एज मीडियन नव इंजरी ए स्केफॉइड ऑप्शन बी हेमेट ऑप्शन सी ल्यूनेट डी ट्रेपेजियम एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी ल्यूनेट क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी थ्री पॉइंटिंग इंडेक्स साइन इज सीन एज नव पाल सीन ए अल्नार ऑप्शन बी रेडियल C. Median. Option D. Axillary. And the correct answer is option C. Median. Question number thirty-four. Which one of the following statement is wrong about Ab's palsy? A. Abductor of the shoulder are weak. Option B. Upper part of the brachial plexus are involved. C. Supinators are normal. D. Internal rotation of arm. and the correct answer is option c supinators are normal question number 35 pots fracture is a fracture of a lower end of tibia option b lower end of tibia plus fibula option c lower end of tibia plus calcaneum d calcaneum plus talus and the correct answer is option b lower end of tibia plus fibula question number 36 the angle formed by joining a line extended from fracture line of femur neck to an arbitrary line depicting the horizontal plane is a paul's angle b angle of weiberg c q angle d louis angle and the correct answer is option a paul's angle question number 37 a vascular necrosis of head of femur occurs commonly at option a trans cervical region b trochanteric region option c subcapital region d subchondral region and the correct answer is option a trans cervical region question number 38 a patient with hip in abduction and medial rotation is unable to move probable diagnosis is option a posterior dislocation of femur b fracture shaft of femur c fracture neck of femur option d sciatica and correct answer is option a posterior dislocation of femur question number 39 bennett's fracture is a fracture dislocation of base of blank metacarpal option a fourth b third option c second d first and the correct answer is d first question number 40 avulsion fracture of extensor tendon of distal phalanx is option a bennett's fracture b smith's fracture option c mallet finger option d collis fracture and the correct answer is option c mallet finger all in one physiotherapy book for mpt entrance and all competitive exam this book contains seven section that covers most of the topic in four years of bachelor in physiotherapy course who required this book and who will need to purchase this book so students of physiotherapy course of any year can buy this book students who are preparing for master in physiotherapy entrance exam physiotherapist who are preparing for any competitive exam physiotherapist who wants to revise topic of all four years in physiotherapy now how you will buy this book so you can click on the link that given in the description box click on this link and